First of all, I'll be down again next week for the next party. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. What I wanted to talk about with you is that um, as a group of people, you're working really well and you're making very good progress. Okay, really good progress. I think there's a couple of little things that you can really understand that would help you even more. In our midst, we have one outstanding young lady who's probably in the world golf been one of the best young players in the world right here. Okay, and I know Chris and myself have been very fortunate enough to do lots of work with her, Chris especially. What, what I've noticed from Annie all these years is that she has an amazing capability to never see too much wrong with things. I never, in my entire time of being around Annie over the last four years, I've never heard her say, oh, my swing's going no good or I'm not playing very well. I never, ever hear this young lady complain. Wow, you're very special. Okay, so one of the things you've got to learn is golf's extremely difficult. Okay, and we all have, as young people, bodies that are developing. Okay, we're all growing. Some are going this way real quick. A few are going this way, but not many. Um, mainly growing very tall very quickly, and your poor body and brain is trying to keep control of all these muscles that are all getting out of shape and what have you as you become... Um, you know, a young adult. And your golf swing can go off like that. It can be very difficult to do a good job. But if your attitude is good, if your mental stuff is good, it really helps you, okay? So in Annie's case, I've watched her, you know, not swinging very well, but on many occasions go to tournaments and win with her B game, okay? That to me shows a real sign of great character and a person who just says, okay, I'll, no matter what I'm doing, I'm going to go along there and I'm going to get, get the job done. I'm just going to go along and play good golf by doing good mental skills, not getting angry with myself, not getting frustrated with myself. I'll just do what I have to do to get a par, okay? And that's what I find has been outstanding from Annie over these last four years that I've watched, okay? She continues to improve her swing and she's got a way to go yet to be a great swinger. But as a player, she's already very, 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 very good, okay? So you've got to understand there's a big difference between having a great golf swing and being a great player, okay? The idea of your golf swing is to make it consistent that it produces a nice, consistent result. It's not all over the place. We develop things that make it consistent and you can you can find the ball. Okay? Playing the game is about you getting your mental skills very good and being kind to yourself. Okay? So that's all I wanted to say to you. I don't want to hear you. I mean, most of you are very good. I don't want to hear you rubbishing yourself or being critical of yourself. I would rather you say to your coach, it's not going as well at the moment, but you know, let me just, this is what's happening, can you help me get it a little bit better? If you do that, you turn it around very quickly. Okay? So, please be patient with yourself, please be kind to yourself, and enjoy improving that little bit all the time. Okay. Back and hit a few balls before the sun goes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm.